Hello and welcome to EV Review Ireland. My name is Derek Riley and we are at the NADA Easter Show in Las Vegas at the Las Vegas Convention Center. But this is the West Hall and we're trying to get to the South Hall, which is like a 25 minute walk. So what are you going to do? You are going to get in the West Station, part of the boring tunnel over here. This is one of the precast concrete rings. So this is the size of the ring that these beautiful Tesla Model X's and Model Y's use to get you to the central station and also then to the north station. So what we're going to do is jump in, have a look around. I've seen this on TV, I never thought it was going to be here. There's currently no charge for it, maybe it's because of the conference that I'm attending, but we're going to get in, have a look through the tunnel and get out the other side obviously. A couple of minutes ride, so stay tuned. We've got Tesla Model Ys and it's got the branding on the back of it. You can see where it says Vegas Loop there. The Tesla Model Ys. All the way up. Black and white. And then we also have the Tesla Model X over here. This is the one we're going to go in. Hi, how are you? Um, yes, please. While we take the journey, I'm going to talk about some of the stats about the last Vegas Convention Center loop or the LVCC loop. So it's three stations and it has it covers 1.7 miles. It was built in approximately one year and it was using the old Godot tunnel boring machine and we're going to talk about the new boring machine uh, later on in this video. Cost was $47 million. It has two tunnels between the west and the central and then central and south. It has three stations, two surface and one subsurface uh, and they built it while other stuff was going on there. Uh, it, it saves you going across the campus 45 minutes it does it in two minutes we're only taking the journey to the central station today modifications to the car the only thing that i could see was underneath the central console you can see that there is a screen and when we left we were in parking bay eight uh, the screen will also show the driver where they are positioned within the tunnel um, and there's other communication sections within it and then when we pull up here now you'll see that we're pulling into parking bay six um, and that will uh, highlight on the screen. Drivers are also wearing headsets uh, and that's how they communicate with each other I presume or central control. Pulling up here now and you can see the central station, the different bays. I'm going to talk about the boring company in more detail in a little bit. There we Thank you very much. Thank you, take care. Have a good day. So that we are in the central station with the Model Y and you can see it literally took a minute to get all the way over and escalator is going all the way up. As mentioned the um, Vegas Convention Center loop was tunneled by the old Godot Plus tunneling machine whereas Proof Rock is their new tunneling machine and you can see from the diagram here five days it can go uh, across and or underneath a highway and it launches from the surface goes straight into the ground and then emerges from the surface as well so you're not digging a hole dropping a tunnel boring machine or tbm into it and then having to take it back out again it'll go under uh, under what you need it to go under so uh, very interesting and also announced last October was the uh, expansion of the Vegas Loop, uh, not just from the convention center, but it's actually going to cover the whole of Las Vegas. It's going to be 29 miles long and it's going to cover 51 stations. Um, so great to see that Las Vegas and Nevada, Clark County, Nevada, are looking to use this as a, a new form of public transport. Uh, you can see on the screen there exactly the extent of it. So lots of interesting things happening here with the Vegas Loop, the boring company, and obviously part of the, the Tesla family. Hopefully you've enjoyed that quick video of the Loop here at the Las Vegas Convention Center, powered by the boring company uh, with Tesla's driving up and down all the way through. 
Make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel, and remember, if you think an EV is for you, leave it to me and I'll review. Thank you very much for watching.